you for purchasing the Stolting Ready Flavor Burst Soft Serve System. This instructional video will help you set up and operate the color touch panel. The enable or disable serving options allows you to customize serving options to your specific needs or preferences. To make adjustments, press enable or disable serving options in the maintenance menu. The dispense time per selection setting refers to the amount of time in seconds that each flavor will dispense in a multi-flavored serving. A higher number results in wider, more distinct layers of flavor, and a lower number creates smaller layers. To adjust the dispense time per selection setting, press the blue plus or minus buttons. The enable time serving setting allows the machine to automatically shut off syrup flow at a specific time based on the size of the serving selected. A beep sounds when this happens, and the screen notifies the operator to finish the serving. This option helps ensure consistent serving sizes, which is ideal in a self-serve environment. To turn Enable Time Servings on or off, press the blue bar. When the Enable Time Servings is set to on, the operator will be asked to select a serving size when drawing a serving, which tells the machine how much syrup to dispense. When the enabled time servings is set to on, you will be able to edit related settings, which are displayed just below the enabled time serving section of the menu. The white cap setting shuts off syrup flow at a preset time during serving. A beep sounds when this happens, and the screen notifies the operator to finish the serving. The time between when the syrup stops flowing and the beep allows the spout to clear out any residual syrup flavor resulting in a white cap of unflavored product at the top of the serving. This not only looks better, but also eliminates flavor carryover from one serving to another. The white cap setting allows you to adjust the amount of time between when the syrup stops and when the beep sounds. A longer amount of time creates a larger white cap, and a shorter amount of time creates a smaller one. Press the plus or minus buttons to adjust the white cap time. If you don't want a white cap at all, simply set the time to 0.0. .0. The Automatically Fit Selection into Serving Time, or Auto Fit setting, monitors the amount of flavor in each serving. When this setting is on, the system will squeeze an extra flavor selection or two into a serving by automatically lowering the dispense selection time to match the minimum dispense time per selection, creating an ideal mixture. When the auto fit setting is off, the system can only fit a certain amount of flavors into each serving, depending on how long the serving dispenses and how long each flavor is set to dispense. To turn the auto fit setting on or off, press the blue bar. The minimum dispense time per selection setting is only available when the auto fit setting is on. This is the shortest amount of time each flavor will dispense when the auto fit is active. It ensures that the auto fit doesn't allow too many flavors in one serving, or make the dispense time of each flavor too short, which would result in blended flavors instead of layering them. Press the plus or minus buttons to adjust the minimum dispense time per selection setting. The Show Quick Dispense screen is available for eight flavor systems, and it places all of your serving options on one screen. While this may be convenient for employees, this is not ideal for a self-serve environment. To turn the Show Quick Dispenser screen on or off, press the blue bar. The Enable Automatic Dispensing mode adds a Touch to Dispense button to the main selection screen. This setting is only available for FCB systems with an automatic draw system installed. When this setting is enabled, the operator selects their desired flavor or flavors, then presses the Touch to Dispense button. The screen displays instructions on how to draw their serving, and another button is displayed for when they are ready to dispense. The serving will automatically dispense until the Stop button is pressed or the serving size is reached. To turn on the Enable Automatic Dispensing mode and add a Touch to Dispense button to the menu selection screen, Press the blue bar to on. The Display Predefined Recipes setting adds customizable recipes to your menu. Recipes can be created by combining sets of flavors together. One example would be combining chocolate, banana, and strawberry together to create a banana split recipe. Press the blue bar to on to enable the Display Predefined Recipes setting and add a Use Recipe button to the menu. This allows users to select a recipe just as easily as they could select a single flavor. 
The display flush button on serving screen setting will add a flush spout button on the main screen. This allows the operator to flush the spout with sanitizer solution between servings, clearing out any residual syrup and reducing carryover between servings. Please note that this is not recommended if your machine is used in a self-serve environment, as customers may accidentally activate the flushing feature without realizing what it does. Press the blue bar to on to enable the display flush button on serving screen setting and add a flush spout button to the main screen. If the spout is not clearing all the product during the flushing function, you can adjust the injector flush time by pressing the blue plus or minus buttons. The always run injector when serving option allows the flavor burst motor and gears to run even when syrup is not being dispensed, such as when serving a vanilla cone. This can be helpful to create a more consistent serving experience between flavored and unflavored servings. It is required for crunch cream systems, but not available for FCB systems. To turn on the always run injector when serving setting, press the blue bar to on. The injector motor speed setting allows you to increase or decrease the motor speed. To adjust, press the blue plus or minus buttons. The show vanilla only option allows the operator to serve a plain vanilla flavor. Press the blue bar to on to add a vanilla only button to your menu.